Just because summer is over doesn't mean there's nothing to do around town. Visit Baltimore has a laundry list of fall events coming up, starting with the Book Festival. I sat down with President and CEO of Visit Baltimore to learn all about the upcoming fun happenings. Fall is upon us, and that means there is plenty to do. Al Hutchinson from Visit Baltimore is here to tell us how to fall for fall here in Tom City. Thanks so much for being with us this morning. Thank you, Nicole, for having me. Tell me what is happening in, in the fall time in Baltimore. Well, fall is going to be extremely busy. Mm -hmm. um, you know, we have next weekend actually kicking off the Book Festival is back, which mm -hmm. is a great free event that comes annually here in Inner Harbor. And this year we have a bunch of great authors. Mm -hmm. But I have to give a shout out to April Ryan, one of our local Baltimore natives, yes. and Morgan State grad who will be a part of that. So that's going to be really cool and exciting. But also following that in October, we have Fleet Week mm -hmm. returning to Baltimore. And that's a great example of uh, expressing gratitude for the great nautical history here in Baltimore. 2,500 sailors coming in, over a dozen ships. We're going to have the Thunderbirds flying over Baltimore. So that's going to be a great time for folks to come into the city. And then we're also for the first annual Edgar Allan Poe Festival, mm -hmm. which will be uh, in October as well. So celebrating the death of uh, Edgar Allan Poe. So it'll be a great time. A lot happening. What's the most exciting thing you're looking forward to? Well, I think it's just the fun nature of folks coming to our city to see what's what's going on. We've gotten a lot of rave reviews mm -hmm. from a number of great publications, but the arts are really cool in Baltimore this fall. So uh, Amy Sherrill, who's the portrait for the First Lady, uh, Michelle Obama, she's being represented at the Baltimore Museum of Art with mm -hmm. her work, along with a, a lot of other local artists who were Baker Artist Award winners. So that's happening. That started last week and runs through October. And then our very own John Waters will be recognized also at the Baltimore uh, Museum of Art starting in October. So a lot of great things are happening. And the Lewis Museum is they're going to be doing a great Robert uh, Bearden exhibition of 20, 70 of his art mm -hmm. work will be happening in October through uh, November as well. So it's a really, really exciting time for the arts community as well as all the great events happening in Baltimore. Plenty to do in Charm City, plenty happening. Thanks so much for being with us. Remind people really quickly where they can find all the events. They can go to Baltimore.org and find out all these great events in addition to more that will be coming this fall. Awesome. Happening, lots happening in Charm City. More news, weather, and traffic after the break.